Alright, so hello everybody and uh, welcome back to Let's Play Shogun Total War. So when we left off last time, we just captured this region, I believe. And we were going after this region and we just built that. Um, I think. Yes. Okay, so. Um, we don't have a garrison here yet. Uh, I don't think anyway. Uh, let's see. Uh, no, we do have a garrison, we just don't have anything in the garrison. Alright, so, we've got warrior monks coming out over here, so, yeah, we've got warrior monks coming out over there. And, um, I think I'm going to try to eliminate all the rebels and everything, um, namely, uh, these ones right there. But I'm going to wait a few turns to do that. And I'm going to check and see if this... Okay, I can't train any units yet, so... Just end. Your clan is now the richest in all of Japan. No other clan has such a large annual income. Well, that's, that's good. We do control quite a few regions. Um, rather large clan. And I need... Before I do anything, I need to reinforce all of my other units because I think there is a building you can make that will make it s that was a bit redundant alright so down 20% alright so there is a um, I believe anyway that there is a building that you can make at least there is in uh, the other ones that I've played other Total War games that will um uh, retrain units. I don't I'm not sure if that's in this one. Um I don't proving them are out no. I don't I don't think I don't know if it is in this one actually. Now that I say that. Either that or I need a bigger castle or something. But uh let's see. I'm gonna send you here. Still need reinforcement. And we're going to wait a few more turns. This video is going to be shorter, only around 14 minutes or so. Shorter than the other ones. I'm going to try to keep them around 15 minutes from now on. Because 30 minutes is a bit too long for some people. So I'll keep it shorter. Um, I may have to cut off early and uh, come back a little bit later because... I really don't like people like interrupting my uh, commentary, so whenever somebody comes down the stairs, I will say, like, I'll be back in a minute or something like that, because I really don't like it when... Did nothing happen that turn? Apparently not. I don't like when people interrupt my uh, commentary. It kind of irritates me and kind of lowers the quality of a video if you... Uh, have somebody interrupt. Alright, so I set this video to be uh, only at 30 frames per second. I've originally been recording at 60 frames, but I did a test recording and it locked out at 30 FPS when I was uh, fighting and the like and stuff like that. And uh, so I'm just going to keep it at 30 FPS. I gonna see how this goes it looked exactly the same as 60 fps and it's like half the size so it's really uh good to keep it like this um so we got some warrior monks here we're still training somewhere we need a few more archer units and also uh i didn't really know this but okay harvest was average harvest or harvest uh tongue twister but uh I uh, discovered that this game has a lot different mechanics. Can I garrison you? No. Okay, this game has different mechanics than the Total War game that I'm used to, which is Rome Total War. I'm not going to be doing a Let's Play of that, um, just because I've played it too much and I'm kind of bored of uh, Rome Total War. Not that it is a bad game or anything, it's a really good game. Um, I just 
you know, you can get bored of games that you like a lot sometimes. And I haven't been putting out many videos recently because I've been playing Dark Souls. Believe it or not. Uh, and <coughs> surprisingly, I've actually been having a lot of fun with it. Uh, so, yeah, I took the time to make this video now. Ooh, what? Rebel Army. Say what? Oh, there. There's a Rebel Army there, I guess. Alright, so... Let's see. Just produced a archer unit here, and I'm going to send you there. We just produced an archer unit that is garrisoned again. And I'm going to make two more of you. And then we'll probably be pretty good. Yeah, so as I was saying, uh, this game is a lot different in its mechanics as... Um, Clan is now the most advanced. Ooh, okay, that's good. But uh it's uh the mechanics of like like morale and fatigue is much different. And the AI in this game is are pretty much campers. Uh as we have discovered. They're pretty much just gonna sit there and wait for you if you're attacking anyway. Which I haven't been on the defense yet, so I think if the timer runs out and you're the attacker and nothing's happened yet, you lose instantly. So I'm gonna try to keep that under control. Right now I've got 5,500 Koku, and I should merge all these units and trade some samurai. And uh, so yeah, the fatigue system is different because. In this one, this is the first Total War game in the series, so there is uh, less, uh, the, it's not as balanced as some of the later games, uh, as I have, I have discovered from uh, experience, and uh, uh, yeah, the fatigue runs out much quicker in this game, as I have noticed. Oh. Ooh. Yeah, smaller harvest than usual, 20%. And, uh, let's see. So we got a decent sized army here. We just got 60 units there. And you didn't produce a unit this time because I didn't tell you to. Alright, so. We got a decent sized army here. Um. Decent sized army here. I could take them out with just. Um, that, like that, but, as I have stated, I'm not very good at this game, and so, yeah, and there's only eight units there, um, basically it's a almost worthless unit, because you can't do anything with them, and, uh, two arch. I would prefer to have more archer units in that group there, and, ooh, yeah, all this training units is just, uh, draining my money, pretty much. Okay, so I got archers here. No, archers here. Right, so now we've got three units of archers, four units of warrior monks, and I would. Per they don't. Rebels don't have any cavalry units, if I remember correctly. But there's no sense in not being safe. No. I don't think I'll need archer. I mean, uh. Not archer units. I don't think I will need the uh, Yari Samurai or Yari Ashigaru. I love saying that word. I don't know. It's fun to say. And uh, I think I'm going to attack next turn. Oh, and since it's a lower harvest this year, it's going to be pretty painful on my uh, money this year. So I'm going to attack them now. Oh, no, 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 no. I remember this. Alright, so I'm going to keep that unit of 8 there. And I'm going to have a unit of 60 untrained here. That won't do anything at all, but uh, it'll keep the uh, people under control, I guess. And that's maybe a problem. Uh, yeah, if they decide to attack, I'm going to have to send these units up there to help out. 
But for right now, I'm gonna send this here, and uh, I know setup's gonna be it was going to be uh, 15 or so minutes, but I'm going to uh, fight this battle completely out, and uh, that's F5, not F4. Let me stretch the screen here. I don't know why it does that, but it does. It's a fine day. We'll attack. So I'm going to do something a little bit different. Usually I've just been grouping together the uh, units that are similar. So um, And that hasn't really worked out that well. So I'm going to just select everybody first of all. And I'm going to set them up in a formation that is going to have not skirmish uh, left hand offensive center offensive I'm gonna have the center offensive sort of uh, technique type thing and I am going to send them I think right here so I'm going to have everybody go right there. And they try to come to this mountain. I will have plenty, plenty, plenty of time to uh, adjust and uh, account for them. But I should win this fight regardless of uh, how bad I do because... I'm actually thinking about a strategy this time. See, uh, I mean, you can't see it, but uh, my FPS in the corner is locked out at 50. I mean, 30 FPS. And uh, it wouldn't go any higher in the test that I did, so I'm just going to keep it as such. And I think this will actually be a pretty good strategy. I've got my archers there. Where is my Yari Ash? Garu up front with the warrior monks oh there it is okay so let's see if I can't see them and of course as uh, always they're just gonna camp up there so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and send my units right there and if they try to do anything I'll just rain down death upon them it's going to take a while for my guys to get up over the hill, so if they charge while I'm doing this, uh, it'll be an uphill battle. Ooh, ooh, movement, movement. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and group all my offensive units. Ooh, I have all my people grouped together, apparently. I'm going to group all five of my offensive units and all three of my archer units. Group, thank you. And I'm going to send everybody up a little bit further just not much not much but a little bit because those samurai archers ooh I can get them from here good alright so uh... I'll be right back in a little bit alright see ya alright sorry for the interruption I'm back uh... and my archers are what? Okay, my archers are not shooting for some reason. Why not shooting? Okay. I don't know. They're not shooting, though. Um, so I may have to move my people up a little bit. Okay, there they go. Now they're shooting. And that'll pretty much be death for them, because we're shooting up over a hill, and that will really put a dent in their army. That is not all of their army though. But okay, what the heck? Why Why are more of my people dying than their people? This makes no sense. Right, so I'm gonna send these oops. I'm gonna send these guys up to like kinda make them run up and kinda form a uh defensive line kind of thing. And they've got a lot more units back there. And this really isn't f uh, just to uh,
this isn't just to attack their uh, archers. It's also, see, as these guys are swinging around, I'm going to have you. So look, now we are completely surrounding those uh, warrior monks, and I don't know what you guys are doing. I told you to go there. So now we've got complete surrounding of those... warrior monks which will uh kill them pr pretty much and now our archers are going to continue to rain down upon the enemy uh warrior monks that are back there and uh if all goes well this should be a victory for my troops anyway but, yeah, i don't know it uh, I can't get the oh. I'll send I'll have one of my units attack them the one on the right edge but really what okay so I had more units and uh I had more units and I was completely encompassing them. What's up with that? It really makes no sense to me and kind of pisses me off, honestly. So why are they tired? I only sent them up a little bit walking up a little bit. really pisses me off. They shouldn't be running away right now. And these guys shouldn't be wavering. They're just... I don't understand. Is something wrong with my copy of the game? Or s Is something wrong with my copy of the game? I don't think so. Really? What on earth? Why are you guys running? Please stop. Okay, just sit here. Sit there. Why did I lose so many units? Oh, crap. I just minimized the game. Please don't crash. Please don't. Okay, good. I'm not comprehending why I lost so many units. When I clearly had the advantage, I was fighting downhill. Yeah, I was pretty much fighting downhill. And I was completely surrounding them. And this makes sense how? I don't know. I think I'm going to lose this battle because of that. And screw it. Turn around and kick their butts. Don't run. You're almost out of arrows anyway. You've got some Yari Ashigaru to help you. There's samurai archers over there. Not really sure what they're doing. <sighs> Don't understand the mechanics of this game at all shouldn't work like this. It doesn't work like this, honestly. This isn't how the game works. And it's honestly a bit ridiculous. Okay, so there's those warrior monks dying, dead. So I've got the same units as them. I've got more units. I've got my archers raining death upon them. And what happens? They win? That's just a bit ridiculous. I think that may be the match for me. Oh, 
Okay, yeah. I'm gonna have all my units back up some. Come on, back back here. Oh my goodness. Where are you going? No, 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 no. What are you... I didn't tell you guys to go there either. Told... Told... I'm really pissed off this game right now at this point. Uh... Why, why are they still running? Stop. Oh my goodness. How did they? <sighs> Somebody could please tell me why that didn't work. That strategy should have been foolproof. Alright, so I should murder these guys. Like, murder. Like, instantly kill them. Because I am fully encompassing them with all my units. Come on, stop. Stop that. Well, I may be able to pull a victory out of the hat here with heavy losses once again. I'm going to rally you guys. Alright, so if I can get all these guys to run, then I'll be set. Uh, yeah, so this game uh, doesn't really seem even or balanced in the slightest. Uh, it seems that my strategies have all been failures. Um, Alright, so the enemy general is fleeing. Basically slaughtering all of them. Oh my gosh. That was not a victory. That was like a fail. Oh my goodness. Alright, so that's gonna about wrap it up for this video. And next time, hopefully I can learn something about this game. Um, I don't know. This, just like the strategies don't seem logical at all. It was like he was hiding and I knew where all of his units were. And, uh, as you saw, my units got complete coverage of the so the flanks. And yet, and we're being shot on by archers. We had more units in there. We were shooting at their units with archers. And somehow, they won. It really doesn't make any logical sense to me. And, uh, next time I hope I will do a little bit better. And, uh, see you guys later. Um, bye.